Hi, I'm Eric and in this video I want to show you the mirror tool. So uh, I'm going to tab into edit mode here and hit one on my numpad. Press one on the number row to uh, go into vertex selection. Control Z so that I can uh, delete half of this monkey so that Shusan can help us showcase how the mirror tool works. Now there is a mirror tool and there is um, a mirror modifier as well right here and they work slightly differently there is also like symmetry um, symmetry options so that when we're modeling we're modeling on both sides uh, without an, an actual modifier for instance and other tools in blender but this is the mirror tool so we're gonna select everything here so that we can see how this monkey shifts the mirror tools can be accessed uh, through the mesh menu here and uh, mirror and these are all uh, part of the same tool control m is the um, is the shortcut uh, so um, let's uh, just uh, press control m and then we get into an interactive mode so if i press uh, x for instance we will toggle between uh, first the global x axis and the local if we hit x again and then back to uh, not mirroring or I can go Y or Z and both as well so I'm just gonna right click to undo that and uh, I'm gonna go mesh and uh, go up here and select uh, for instance X global and after we have even if you use the shortcut key or the menu we still get this uh, operator panel down here so that we can select uh, both multiple of these or just a single one and we can also select the axis that we want to mirror across so if we want to let's say that we want to mirror across the view here and then we'll need to check some of these to update them uh, and that should uh, update yes yeah, so you can see that that's now on an angle some thanks to our view All right, so I can go back to global. So I'll have to toggle these to update that orientation there. So this is kind of what the mirror does. It mirrors across um, kind of the medium point of the selected geometry. Uh, if I take, um, go out to object mode here with tab and I use the modifier instead, I go to mirror we get a full copy instead on the other side. That's the, the first difference. And it also mirrors across the origin point instead of the uh, selected geometry. Since in object mode, we can only have the object selected or not selected. All right, so that's the, um, the mesh and mirror tools. Uh, I hope you found it useful. And uh, thanks for watching. See you in another video.